all right guys so we do have a little bit more information uh pertaining to some more things coming with the third year anniversary a uh, few things to talk about today but before we do get started make sure you go down below hit that red subscribe button if you do enjoy the content leave a like as well and without further ado we can go ahead and get started so first uh this first of all guys you know this is going to be butchered google translate is I mean, it's helpful, but it it kind of it's kind of sucks at things like this. But uh, obviously, we have the Extreme Z Awakening for the kid Gohan coming on February 14th, which is Valentine's Day. Now, uh, a little bit more I'm gonna get into about uh, the 14th. That I'll get to that later, guys. So right now, I'm just gonna struggle through reading this for a second. So obviously, uh, the notice is about the Extreme Z Awakening Gohan, and this is in game too as well, guys. I woke up. This is the first thing I saw this morning. I'm trying to hurry up and pump this video out before work. So uh, let's struggle through this reading. Now, expectations of growth. In this time of Extreme Z Battle Gohan Childhood is the Limit Z Awakening. That's obviously telling us that he's getting his Extreme Z Awakening sometime soon. Um, Son Gohan is going to be a friend in the story events, large fierce battle, fight, Nameku star, yeah, yeah, whatever, whatever. Let us grow in preparation for the Ultimate Z Battle Gohan Childhood. In addition, each as a reward of events, clear potential ball, blah, blah, blah. Okay, that's just letting us know the rewards we're going to get, uh, this, that, and the third. So, basically, guys... Uh, the category, well, this isn't stating it right here, but basically the category that is going to be strong against this event is obviously the Namek Saga category. So that leads me to believe a couple of things about this Extreme Z Awakening and this event. Um, obviously, which is kind of a cool thing to me, the uh, the kid Gohan is going to be strong against this event himself. So if you did farm him up to 100% already, you can take him along on this event. And he's going to do pretty decently against this event himself because he is in that Namek Saga category himself. Um, also, this leads me to believe that we have to be getting at least one more banner. We have to be getting at least one more banner, guys, because let me let me show you something real quick. Now, this is the Namek Saga category uh, that we have thus far. Two LRs. LR Frieza and LR Ginyu, which 90% uh, of us don't even have LR Ginyu. So if you want to bank on LR Frieza, that's 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 on you guys. Uh, then we have a few Gokus, the Kid Gohan, obviously, like I just stated, um, which like, I still think that's pretty cool that you can take him against his own event. Uh, full Power Frieza, uh, TUR LR Frieza, a couple more Kid Gohans. This Ink Gohan is pretty good right here. The Ink Kid Gohan, um, the Scouter Vegeta. Uh, I, I kind of don't get why these golden freezes are here. Not too sure about that. If anybody can clarify that for me, let me know. I mean, I'm not complaining. That gives us a little bit more options. And then that's that's pretty much all we have. So if you guys can see any type of team coming together off of what we see here, because I, I can't see it. I mean, the angry Kamehameha Goku, he's he's pretty decent. A uh, full power freezer, he's obviously really good. But other than that, I really don't see any way that we can put together a proper team from the units that we have right now. So, like I said, that leads me to believe that, you know, we're going to have at least one more banner. Um, for all of you that think we're going to get another Super Saiyan Goku and another Full Power Frieza, don't give up hope because we need we need other units guys i don't see any way that we can put together a proper team with the units that we have right now i mean how many ssrs do we even have i mean okay okay we we have exactly seven TURs. exactly seven TURs, guys and ginyu I, i'm gonna say six because i don't i don't even think ginyu counts because 99 percent of us don't even have ginyu so we have to get another banner i expect another banner that night probably when this all comes out so i know there's gonna be a lot of streams um i don't really know if i'm gonna extreme the extreme z awakening or summon on the banner yet not too sure about that guys um oh yeah one more thing really quickly if you didn't know already the int type banner is up go ahead and do your one multi on that get your orbs uh you might have a chance at pulling lr gohan i might go in on it one time obviously uh you can't you can only go in on it one time but i'm gonna give it a try see what i can do i see if i can redeem myself from that uh int banner tragedy on global so let's hop over here guys talk a little bit about the card uh break them down a tad bit and then there was one more thing i wanted to talk about as well so the kid gohan he is the two key uh 30 leader 30 being hp attack and defense four strength types super attack is my senko uh causes supreme damage to enemy now he is a nuker guys passive skill is attack and defense plus 12 percent for every key sphere obtained and key plus one in attack plus five percent for every rainbow key sphere obtained 
Link skills are the Saiyan lineage, all in the family, Saiyan warrior race, Z fighters, which I'm glad he has that, uh, Gaze of Respect, The Innocence, another one I'm glad he has, and Shattering the Limit. So, no prepare for battle on this guy. He is in the Hybrid Saiyans category and the Namek Saga category, of course. Uh, and I think that is about all it. Oh, yes. Guys, make sure you go farm him up. Um, another thing that I didn't talk about, uh, my boy Troop did talk about this, though. Um, if you haven't done this already, guys, make sure you go farm up two copies of this guy. Get the second one to SA5. And then when the Extreme Z, Z Awakening comes, you can feed him in and get him to SA15 that way. Now, uh, I'm not going to go too in-depth on how to do that, guys. I mean, I just pretty much explained it. self-explanatory right there. But if you do need a little bit more of an in-depth explanation on that, like I said, my boy True dropped a video on that. Make sure you go and watch that. So... Um, one thing that kind of worries me about this whole event going on, and I will hop over here uh, to the banners. Let me find this. Okay, so when the Broly had his Extreme Z Awakening, they gave us uh, two AGO units on his banner that were featured as well. Uh, I guess they were, you know, trying to insinuate that um, use an use a AGO team against this event, which uh, I think the category that was strong against this event was the Hybrid Saiyans category, and I'm they didn't give us another another Hybrid Saiyans category leader, which is fine because I know plenty of people that did beat this with an AGO team. Uh, but as far as the other one, the AGO Goku, the Super Saiyan three AGO Goku, which is right here. I don't know anybody that beat this with a tech team. Nobody, guys. I don't know anybody that beat this with a tech team. Um, I think the category that was strong against this was the Revived Warriors category, which I do know plenty of people that did beat it with that category. Um, I think LR Bojack was pretty much a staple that you had to have when you went up against this event, especially for the last stage. And it, Golden Frieza, those two were a must. As far as the uh, tech, as far as the tech team, I, I don't know anybody that beat it with that. Um, so that leads me to believe that when this hopefully we do get an Amic Saga category banner guys Hopefully we do um, I can't see it be I can't see it being anything else besides another uh, Super Saiyan Goku and another full power Frieza Which we haven't gotten any information on guys uh, We don't know if we're gonna get another Namek Saga category leaders to be honest with you But I don't see any reason why we wouldn't because we hop back over here This category is so lackluster right now. I mean it does have two LRs, but like I said previously guys as a matter of fact, in the, in the comment section right now, leave if you have LR Ginyu. If you have LR Ginyu, just, just drop yes. Yes, I have him. Because I want to know how many people actually have him. I don't have him. I, I don't think I know anybody that has him. Not even like some of the bigger guys that I know. I don't I, Like Troop doesn't have him. Um, I don't think Muscle. As a matter of fact, I'm pretty sure Muscle doesn't have him. Uh, d does Nano or Rhyme have this guy even? I don't. I literally don't know anybody that has LR Ginyu. Um, LR, LR Frieza, we can all farm him up whenever. I might actually do that this weekend. Might actually, matter of fact, is that open today? I think that's open today, actually, or tomorrow. It's either open today or tomorrow. Um, so I might farm up my LR Frieza to get ready for this. Um, you're free to play Goku <laughs> if you want to take him along. Uh, Kid Gohan, remember what I said, guys. Get you two copies of this guy. I know that's kind of strenuous. You probably don't want to do it, but go ahead and get your two copies of this guy so you can go ahead and feed him in uh, when the Extreme Z Awakening does come. Get him to SA15, and then you're done with him. He's 100% SA15. Show him off to your friends, guys. Show him that, hey, you know, I I'm a try hard. I grinded this guy all the way up to SA15 off of straight dupes. <laughs> off of straight dudes. I that that's not gonna be me, guys. Can't be me. Can't be me. And then watch me drop a video next week of doing that exact thing. Um, but anyway, guys, that is about all I have for today. Let me let me actually see if I can summon for you guys real quick. I might I might drop a quick single summon for you guys. See what I can do. Let me pull up Knox real quick. I don't think there was anything else. Um like I said, guys, if you're hoping for a new Super Saiyan Goku or a new Full Power Frieza, those hopes are still alive because we don't know what could be coming on that banner. Um, like I said, we do need a new Namek Saga category leader because this category is by far the worst category right now. And if they think we're going to beat the event, if they think we're going to do 30 stages with just uh, these units right here, I don't, I don't see that happening. I really do not see that happening. Now, like I said, I don't know why these golden freezes right here. Like I said, guys, clarify that for me down below. Waiting for my knocks to pull up right now because I do want to uh, summon for you guys really quick. Even if I don't have stones right now, I'll just go ahead and buy like six stones so I can't single for you guys. Watch me pull in a lot real quick because I've been doing that for some reason lately. I have no idea. Um, Actually, if this takes too long to load, we're not going to do it because I'm not going to uh, waste you guys time. If this takes too long. We're just not going to do it. Uh, 
yeah I'll, I'll just i'll just drop a single in the next video guys so i appreciate you all watching once again i, I will have another update for you in the next couple of days we're gonna see what news drops uh, make sure you stay tuned on Twitter, guys. Make sure you stay tuned on Facebook, DBZ Space. Don't really know who's going to drop the news first, but just be prepared, guys. Like I said, I will drop another video on it when the time comes. And without further ado, I will see you all in the next video. Peace.